Hey there, and this is a quick video for this uh, this farmhouse sink. So this is made by Kohler. This is the White Haven sink. Uh, just as far as specs, it fits in a 36 inch wide slot. And obviously you can see um, it's a, a uh, undermount uh, uh, sink, double bowl sink. So this has been installed for about a year. I'll take a step back so you can kind of see what it looks like with the faucet and everything there. Um, overall, I love the way it looked and love the way it turned out. So let me tell you some of my thoughts and impressions about the sink and kind of how it's held up. Uh, durability as well, ease of clean, all those different things like that. So first off, um, the undermount part, I'm a big fan of that. I like having a little drop from the top of the countertop into the sink. So um, I don't know why I like that, because I'm six feet tall, you'd think I'd want it to be higher up, but I find it easier to put heavier things in there or just anything to go into the sink. Plus I like the way this looks, all the white farmhouse sink uh, style um, sitting in front of the cabinet. So I think that looks great. Um, as far as the, the two basins itself, uh, I'm a big fan of having two of them and having them a little bit different size. So typically the larger one is used for washing. The smaller one is used for stacking up things that uh, need to be uh, dried out or the larger for rinsing and then this is for drying as well. Um, but with this little kind of like half wall or little pony wall, that comes in handy too because if you need to fill the sink all the way maybe to soak something or do something uh, with more water, you have uh, plenty of way and ability to do that. Now this one has, uh, on both drains there are garbage disposals, here's the buttons for both of those. I think that's a really good idea, especially with kids in the house, they're going to scrape food into there or things are going to fall in. Um, you're not sure, uh, you won't always have the right side where the food that can go down the disposal is going to be there. So having both I think makes it a lot easier. That being said, under the main drain is a larger, much more powerful disposal and a smaller, uh, lighter disposal is over on that side. Um, as far as durability and so forth. so. One of my favorite things about sinks like this is that the corners are all smooth and rounded. Um, if you've ever had a sink where you have like straight 90 degree angle corners, they look good, but you get a lot of little guck and you know stuff that gets stuck in the corners and in between where the vertical and the horizontal wall kind of come together. Not the case with this at all. Because it's all nice and smooth, everything will just kind of slightly, you know, slide down into the bottom of the sink and down the drain. Makes it really easy to wash too because it's just rounded there. So I'm a really big fan of that. Now, as far as like, you know, scratching and the, the coloration of it with it being a white sink, you're going to have a slight uh, change of coloration there, but not really. Very, very minimal, if I'd say anything. There is a tiny little scratch here. This happened because of the, uh, one of the grates. I think one of the, the plastic pieces came off in there. But having these grates in the bottom has made a big difference to just help ensure that you don't have any scratches or anything like that in the bottom of the sink. So I like having these in place as well. As you see, they're very easy to pull out um, if you need to rinse under there or clean or you want to do anything so overall guys um, I'm really incredibly happy with this thing I think it looks really good it does the job it functions great for a, a busy house um, the two sink component or the two basin component is very helpful durability has been great cleaning has been great so a big fan of this thing if I were to do it all over again I think that the same sink would be put into place. So hope that helps you out. If you're thinking about getting a sink like this, hopefully this was some good information for you. Appreciate you st uh, staying by and watching this video. If this was helpful, hit the thumbs up in the corner and I'd appreciate that. Thanks.